Coleman here from VW1.com. I'm going to show you the Windows Mobile Marketplace for your Windows Mobile phone. Windows Mobile Marketplace is an app center that allows you to download the latest Windows Mobile applications. It's very similar to the BlackBerry App World and iTunes App Store. First thing it does, it checks for updates of the marketplace. If there isn't any, it brings you to the main screen here. Now on the main screen, you have a few options here. The top here, you can search for an application if you know the name. You can see some of the more popular and um, featured apps here. Then you have different um, sections that you can sort through the apps with. You can go by showcase, which showcases the latest applications and the more popular ones. You can go by most popular, most that have been downloaded. You can check out what's new, what's been recently approved. And you can sort by categories. There isn't that many apps in here yet, but there, it's growing. And I've seen apps uh, come, coming in at, at, at a pretty decent pace. The approval process is pretty quick for this. And you can go to my application section, which I'll show you in a second, to manage your applications. So let's go back to most popular and let's download a particular application. We'll go to Microsoft My Phone. And when you tap on the application to install it, it'll let you know here at the top what the price is. And the prices range from free to about 20 bucks. And then it lets you know the star rating here, obviously one through five. And then it gives you a description right here and some of the features. And you can check out the reviews, check out the reviews here. You can see a list of reviews and what star rating they've given them. And um, we tap on this, it gives you more information if they've written, written more and the date that they did the review on. And you can also see more screenshots. There's only one here, but if you wanted to see more, more will show up here. And now all you have to do if you want that application is tap on install. Now, you need a Windows Live ID to install, so you want to make sure you sign in with your Windows Live ID. If not, you can go to Microsoft and uh, sign up for one. You don't have to have a Hotmail or a Live account to do so. You can use your regular email address and just make it Windows Live enabled, which gives us the passport access to, to get into Windows Mobile Marketplace. And um, all you need to do from here is just tap install. Now, if it needs more to install, like I downloaded an application that needed uh, .NET Compact Framework 3.5, it downloaded that automatically, then installed the um, then installed the application. If not, you just tap on install. And if it's a paid application, it'll ask you want to charge to your card, or if you have a card you want to put on it, you have you have to uh, tap in your card information there if you don't have it previously saved and it'll charge that particular card. And there's also the feature if your cell phone company supports it, it'll charge straight to your cell phone bill too. And as you can see here, it's installing, it's pretty quick, and it doesn't even prompt you for anything, you just go straight to the installation. And it's, you see it's installing one of one, and you just let it install. You can still go through the App Store if you want to while it's installing. As you can see here, it will actually head over to the My Application section. And up here in this section, you can see where updates are, apps that are ready to be installed. Like if you previously uninstalled it, you can have it reinstall itself again by going up here to ready install. You can rate the application. You can also remove the application from this section here. So that's pretty much it. We'll just let this application finish installing here. It goes pretty quickly depending on the app. And um, other than that, that's pretty much Windows Mobile Marketplace right there. It's a, it's, it's a great start. It's a very... Um, smooth and very um, slick interface to go through. It's a very simple interface to go through to get your applications. Um, it's currently only available on Windows Mobile 6.5 phones, but someone was able to go online and extract the cab and it does work on Windows Mobile 6.1 phones. You would just um, need to download the cab from the Bowman pack. I'm going to include the cab in each one of the Bowman packs so you can download it from there. And um, official Windows Mobile 6.1 and 6.0 support is going to be coming later in the year. But you can obviously get a sneak peek at it and actually download and use a lot of the applications just by going to the Bowman Pack. And I'll have the cab file in there for you to install Windows Mobile Marketplace. So this is Bowman from BW1.com showing you Windows Mobile Marketplace. Reminding you to follow us on Twitter, subscribe to our RSS feed, subscribe to the YouTube channel, check out the Ustream, and remember to live your tech world in high definition.